Gaff prone Joe Biden got Twitter tongues wagging at a stump speech rallying O Biden Bama, Democrats on Saturday. The slip of the tongue came during a short speech in St. Louis. To all of Amy's folks, to all of Pete's folks, to all of Kamala's folks. Beto's folks, I tell you what. What a gigantic difference it's made. We're going to unite this party and unite this country, he said, referring to Democratic presidential primary dropouts Senator Amy Klobuchar of Minnesota, Senator Kamala Harris of California and former South Bend, Indiana, Mayor Pete Buttigieg. If you want to nominate a proud Democrat, a lifelong Democrat, an O Biden Bama Democrat, join us, he urged. The Twitter account, The Democratic Machine, gave the gap a gentle chide. A reminder to some people on here that if Joe Biden refers to himself as O Biden on Tuesday the 17th, it's officially a reference to St. Patrick's Day no matter the context, it tweeted. Others' posters weren't so kind spoke for only seven minutes and still messed up the speech, groused AA supporter of Senator Bernie Sanders, IVT, R. On a sun-soaked but windy day, hundreds turned out for the downtown speech ahead of Missouri's primary, which will be held Tuesday, along with those in Michigan and Mississippi. Biden celebrated his Super Tuesday wins and hit on talking points including affordable health care, access to rural health care, climate change, gun control and reducing student loan debt, and promised to be a unifying force. He also took aim at President Trump, who he said, embraces autocrats and harms relationships with foreign allies. I've met every major foreign leader, Biden said. I would repair our alliances. Biden was expected to visit Kansas City's National World War I Museum and Memorial later Saturday. With news wire services.